Parents of Montgomery County have some serious questions about transparency in the search for a new school superintendent. An issue? Revelations the former superintendent now works at the company that's overseeing the search. Fox Science Tom Fitzgerald live at MCBS headquarters. Uh, Fitz, we've also learned that this replacement will be happening pretty soon here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sooner than you think, MCBS tells Fox 5 they're going to name this new replacement on February 8th. That's next Tuesday. But tonight, members of the Parents Coalition of Montgomery County are calling this search a fiasco after they have learned that the former superintendent, Dr. Jack Smith, who suddenly quit the job almost a year ago, is now employed by the firm Hazard Young and ITEA the company that has been hired by MCPS to conduct this new search. It was back in August that MCPS's Board of Education awarded a $52,000 contract to that firm to hire a new superintendent. Now, right now, Dr. Monifa McKnight, who was Dr. Smith's deputy when he served in the job, is the acting superintendent and has applied for the job. However, Joseph Hawkins, a member of the Parents Coalition tells Fox 5 he was surprised when he looked on the company's website and saw Dr. Smith listed as one of their employees. I think it, should, it, it definitely should be more open, including knowing who the people are that are working and doing a search. I mean, why, is that a, why, why should that be not known? Well, tonight, MCPS acknowledges that that Smith works for the search firm, but insists that he has no role in the naming of this new superintendent or the search. Now, another former MCPS superintendent, Dr. Joshua Sartre, says to Fox 5 that it would be highly inappropriate for a former superintendent to be involved in the search for his replacement. However, Starr tells Fox 5 he believes that there are trust issues involved in these questions and this speaks to the relationship right now between MCPS and some of its parents. So then when you have a, a process, an incredibly important process like selecting a new superintendent, it, it becomes this garbage can that everybody throws all their complaints into. Could there be more transparency in decision making? Could there be more community? Of course there can always be in any search process. We'll find out soon enough in an email to Fox 5. Dr. Smith wrote today, I have not been involved with the MCPS search in any way. There is no conflict. MCPS wrote Fox 5 saying they have remained committed to maintaining confidentiality to the extent that is possible. We're live in Rockville tonight. We'll send it back into you. All right. Good. Thank you. Let's talk a little over for right now as we get to 518 on.